It's called Distiller's Reserve. And for Troy Roberts, it is the culmination of seven years of getting it just right. Well, this whole thing got started with, uh, with aging spiced rum in this little five-gallon barrel right here that I aged rum in just for myself. Rum connoisseurs around the country are anxious. Only 300 bottles of Distiller's Reserve are available starting this weekend. Uh, it's done in the Solera method, which means you never get rid of all the oldest rum from the barrel. Uh, and the oldest rum in here is over three years old now, so it's really gotten good. Handcrafted along its journey, Robert starts with 100% Florida molasses, and he is very fussy about his yeast. Because different yeasts will give you completely different flavors, but all in all, there, there are probably 150 little decisions you make to, to improve the rum and make it better. Every bottle filled by hand. No bottling line. No robots. The bottles are all hand dipped, but before we can hand dip them, we actually take a little roll of tape and we make a little tab so that it will be easy to get to your rum when you're ready to drink it. And yes, for Roberts, the reward is to drink it. It feels really good to take home a bottle of rum that you've spent years making, like the Distiller's Reserve. It's, it's been years, literally, that, that I've been working on it. And to crack open a bottle of that and, and drink it is just, it's wonderful. Reporting for SNN in Sarasota, Chrissy McClarty, the Suncoast News Network.